And good evening, everyone. It's been a wild and terrifying night across parts of the southern tier where tornado warnings were posted and fierce winds left a trail of trouble. News 4's Rachel Kingston is live tonight in Westfield. Westfield really was ground zero for these storms this afternoon. Where I'm standing right now is essentially the direct path of where what we believe was probably a twister blew through. Take a look behind me here. There used to be a 12,000 square foot white oak barn here. As you can see now, all it is is a pile of debris. Mead has lived through many a ferocious storm, but nothing could have prepared him for this. Back in about 520 around here, the winds got really strong, probably 70, 80 mile an hour winds here, and it was raining real hard. It looked like a snowstorm. As you looked outside, it was raining so hard, it was just like a whiteout. The real shock, however, was still to come. And I looked out, and I also noticed that our barn was just completely missing. It was just gone. Yeah, it was completely missing right down to the concrete foundation. Across the street, Nick Coletta was working in his shop when the building around him literally blew apart. And it was roaring bad. I mean, you couldn't even, I mean, you couldn't think or nothing. It was so loud. Now, it just happened within a couple of seconds and just completely totaled it. The garage door now dangles precariously from its metal wire. A huge chunk of Coletta's roof landed in the middle of the street. Even Chautauqua County Highway Department workers couldn't believe it when they got the call. And he says, uh, you have a barn lane in the road down in, on the Westfield Road. And I'm like, no. Because <laughs> it wasn't, you know, it was raining pretty hard, but it wasn't that windy. But then, of course, when I arrived down here, there was a barn lane in the middle of the road. It will take several days for crews to haul away all of the debris. Mead, Coletta, and their families are all right, but this is an experience they won't soon forget. Never had a barn completely obliterated before? No, no, I can't say as I have. This is all new to me. And we're back live here in Westfield where the rain has stopped, but the wind is still blowing, certainly not at uh, tornado force winds, but still pretty breezy out here. Uh, Chautauqua County will take the next couple of days to clean up this scene here. We understand that other damage in other parts of Chautauqua County isn't as severe. This is really, as you can see, about the worst of the storm damage from this afternoon. Reporting live in Westfield, Rachel Kingston for the 10 o'clock news.